Hello everybody and welcome back to Games for Dads and another super cool Cards the Universe and Everything video. Okay, this is part three, the third part of our combo achievements videos. If you haven't seen part one and part two, go and check them out after this video. But today we're going to show you about 20 different combo achievements. Here they are and you can get yourself some cool rewards by doing these achievements. What the combos are, they're one, or not one, but two cards, or sometimes three cards that you play together to get a cool combo. We put together a couple of decks. There's some deck codes there. If you wanna grab all of the cards that we're gonna use in this video, they are all in those two decks there. So maybe worth uh, copying those and giving it a bash. And we are gonna show you, there we go, that's the first deck. So let's have a look at that one. Uh, I'm not going to go through all the cards in the deck. What we do is play some casual games because casual games are just as good as league games if you are trying to achieve the combos. They still count as achievements and that way you can put together these cool decks with loads of combos in them and not worry too much about winning or losing. So let's go and take our first deck in and show you some of these amazing combos. There we go. We are playing Camera Escape. Haven't played you for a long time. Mr. Bot. Here we go. So I will let you know the combos as they come out. Ah, oh, here's a good one to start. Let's have a look. We have got um, here we can go with, I think, the gingerbread man. There we go. Or Nicholas and Pantomoron. I think that's how you say it. That's a cool combo. That's our first one. That combo is called nothing <laughs> i made a mistake on that one never mind okay let's get into it let's take this seriously so have we got a combo here uh here we go nemo and the clownfish fish our friends combo that's a nice one doesn't score very highly only 61 points for that one i'm only going to play two cards so you can see the cards you need for the combos so that was nemo's garden and clownfish Okay, what have we got next? Um, okay, we can do the trees here. Devil tree and this tree, the tree of heaven. This is a nice one, 190 points so far. The heaven and hell combo. Nice one, really cool. I've never played that one before, so that is a first one for me. In fact, a lot of these I haven't played before, so we should get some good achievements. So let's have a look. We've got three odd cards in our hand. Let's see if we can make another combo. Oh, we lost that round. Never mind. On to the next round. So let's have a look. Oh, here we go. Peter Higgs and the God Particle. No surprise there. That is a combo. 151 points for these two. Do we get any buff? The Quantum Excitement combo. Very exciting. Nice combo, that one. Only 151. They're not very powerful, actually, some of these combos. But... They're definitely worth playing in a casual game to get these achievements. Let's have a look. Where are we? Ooh, we're actually 34 points ahead. Not that we're trying to win. Um, have we got anything? Yep, we've got Penelope and Procky. This is a cool one. The Suitors combo. Nice one. Another low scoring combo. Only 63 points. Bear in mind there's no buffs or anything on any of these cards. So if you put them in a real deck, I'm sure you could get them much better than this. Um... I think what have we got here um richard and the gingerbread man there we go i know this one one two six this is a strange one not the gumdrop combo there we go the gingerbread man and richard the third of england i have no idea what the connection is maybe somebody can tell me what the connection is there seems a totally random one. Oh, he played the wrongly accused there's a bonus combo there for you that is dinosaur eggs and the other dinosaur in the middle. I can't remember which one that was. Okay, so we're doing quite well. We're getting a few combos out here. Let's have a look. Ah, oh, the beetles is a good one. Here we go. Those two beetles. The blue mint beetle and the scarab beetle. That is an 83 infinite crisis combo. Nice. I like that one. We're rolling through these combos. This is good. We're going to get quite a lot, I think. Uh, what have we got in our hand? Laser cannon. I can't remember what laser cannon pairs up with. Oh, here we go. Now I do. Okay, so uh, let's do Philosopher's Stone and the Brothers Grimm. Is it the Brothers Grimm? Not sure. Can't remember. Let's do these two. I remember this one. That's no moon combo. That's Mimus and that laser cannon. 161. Not too bad. I think the Brothers Grimm. 
Is it Nicholas? I can't remember who goes with the Brothers Grimm. Let's just try a random combo in a second. Next one out. Oh, here we go. Now we are coming back around with some of these cards. So two of these cards make a combo. Let's try and work it out. I think it's these two. Yeah, key to immortality. There we go. That is the next one. That's a nice one. That was not very many points <laughs> again. About 80 points on that one. Okay, we lost that game, so we will go and go and play another game so we can show you a few more combos. If you have a look here, the weekly quest, we're not interested in that. Let's have a look. One achievement, key to normality completed. Not the gumdrop buttons. Another one, that's two. That's no moon, that's three we achieved with this deck. Fish our friends, that's four. What else did we do? Heaven and hell, that's five. That's really good. The Suitors 6. Wow, I thought I'd done that one before. Uh, Quantum Excitement 7. Any more? Yeah, Infinite Crisis 8 combos we managed to achieve with that one. Wow, that's amazing. That's off that deck. I think that's VV593N if you want to copy that deck. That will give you some of those cards without having to hunt around for them. Okay, we've got another deck ready. Let's go and do a few more. Here we go, straight into it. So we've got some a little bit more complicated one. This is a three card one here. So these three dragons, Kagwa, Selma, and however you pronounce that one, is the Sea Serpent Strike combo. That's an amazing one. 310 points, really high score. And that would work really well. That mythical creatures in a Life on Land deck would be great, actually. Um, well, we've still got the Brothers Grimm in here. Uh, let's get that one out of the way. There we go. Brothers Grimm and Panther, whatever it is, the tail, the tail of Tails combo. There we go. That was the one we didn't play from the other deck. That's cool. Uh, baby's Breath. I can't remember what goes with Baby's Breath. Casper uh, is one of the three wise men or the three kings. That's going to be difficult. We need to get all three of them together. Uh, what have we got here? Ooh. Um, I don't think we've got a combo here. Um, let me have a quick look. Miniature Donkey. I can't remember what went with Miniature Donkey. Bear with me a second. I think we're just past this. No. What was it? Miniature Donkey? The Cow Girl? The last one on the end. Let's just play one card. <laughs> we're definitely not going to get a combo from this one. I'm just trying to remember what goes. I think the next one is Thor. Goes with that one on the end. So let's try and keep that one. Miniature Donkey. What was with Miniature Donkey? Somebody remind me. Let's see if we can get it. If we can work it out without referring to our notes. Okay, let's go on to the next round. What have we got in our hand? Here we go. So there is Thor. And we have now got these two. This is a cool combo. Only 86 points though. Sons of Thor. Modri and Magni. There we go. And Thor, another combo. Miniature Donkey is still sitting there. Arthur Conan Doyle. He goes with that other Arts and Cultures one, which hopefully will come round. There we go. Chris Hippus. This is a funny one. And Arthur Conan Doyle. So let's go with that. Chris Hippus. Oh, my button suck. There we go. Oh, well, wrong card. Oh, dead funny combo. No, I was right. <laughs> there we go. I nearly made a mistake there. I thought I'd play that wrong. Dead funny combo. That is dead funny. It's a nice one. Chrysippus and the Donkey there. So Arthur Conan Doyle, who did he go with? Uh, what have we got here? I think these two... No, we played that one before, didn't we? Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. let's just get these out of the way okay one three five let's try and win this round and then we don't have to start another game oh no we're not going to win this round so yeah these are great the other deck code d7y1eo that's the deck i'm playing at the moment this one's a little bit more complicated because there are two three card combos in this deck which is why i'm kind of not rolling them out as quick as i will oh there we go there we go. That's what goes with Arthur Conan Doyle. The fairies, of course. It's 152. Oh, oh, there we go. Cardboard cutouts combo. 
Nice one. 152 points, not bad. From two cards, don't forget we are only playing two cards so you can see the pairs of the combos. So these two history cards go together. And there's our first king. Let's do these two history ones. Can't remember what this one's called. Let's put that one in the middle. So the combo here is the two history ones. Couple celebration. There we go. So ignore the green one in the middle. That combo was the two history cards there. So we've still got the Brothers Grimm. Have we actually played the Brothers Grimm combo yet? I don't think we have. That's the one that's still puzzling me a little bit. Okay. And we haven't done the Three Kings yet. Oh, I think this one could be the Brothers Grimm. No, that's the one. The Skull of Valentine actually goes with Baby Breath, which we don't have in our hand. Um, and we've got two kings. We need three. So let's just get these out of the way. Hopefully we'll get the kings next. Then I can show you the three kings. That was not bad, but there was no combo. We actually went around. Interesting. Okay, let's keep going. Let's get a few more combos out. I think we've done about 14 so far. Have we got the third king there? No, we haven't. Okay, we'll have to play this one again. So Thor and his sons. Let's get that one out of the way. There's that baby ref. That's the one you need with the... A uh, skull of Valentine. So we definitely must be getting the next king. He must be coming round. Yeah, the three cards are a little bit tricky. Uh, power up. Oh, another bonus one. There we go. I didn't notice that. <coughs> Excuse me. So we're getting a few bonus combos as well. Oh, we didn't get it. Uh, so we still haven't got a combo here. What should we do? Let's just get them out of the way. This is the funny bones one, isn't it? I remember right. Let's get that one out of the way. Dead funny combo. Interesting picture. We are definitely going to lose this round. We only got 57. Oh, and a classic Cassisians. Oh, that's nice. That is those two dolphin cards, if I remember correctly. Nice. Some definitely some bonus uh ones in here. Uh -huh. Here we go. Okay, so these are the three kings. We've got plenty of energy. We've got 116 energy. Not bad. 185. That's a good score. The three wise men combo. I think maybe at Christmas there should be a double bonus on this one. They will buff themselves a little bit. Not much though. 225. You'd think they'd be higher, wouldn't you? But no, they are not. Okay, let's keep going. We've still got baby breath. We haven't played that one yet. You might have to hold that for a little while. Uh, oh, we've got... Okay, I have to do this guy again. Conan Doyle, cardboard cutouts, just to remind you on that one. Let's keep going. 102 points for that combo. That fairy story was quite interesting. I saw a documentary on the fairies and they were cardboard cutouts that's probably why the combo is called a cardboard cutouts um so we got now uh, we have to go with this love oh no that's the wrong card never mind there's nothing here nothing to see here move along please so i'm going to put the link for all these combos uh in the comment section you can check out one of the discord servers from one of the cool Q players who's managed to get pretty much all of them documented. That's where we got ours from. Uh, Brothers Grimm and let's just go. Let's really keep baby's breath. That was a mistake. Is that that electric one again? No, it's not. So actually, this is a little bit of a non-eventful uh, finish to this deck. Let's see if we can just finish off with a couple more. Let's go and see what we can do here. We lost that game i just realized okay so let's go one more time and couple celebration that was the only new one no sons of thought another new one for us that's good and the three wise men only three three new ones no four dead funny that's good it's... and cardboard cutouts five okay we did better than i thought with that deck that is good i think that must put us on about 15 we've shown you so far I think we got a couple more let's have a look at this deck and just finish this one off there's definitely some good ones in here we haven't seen these ones yet so as i said deck codes d7y1eo and vv593n if you put those two codes in 
and then you can see all the combos i put the decks together in order of the combos so you should be able to see if you've got a card missing which ones to take out um but most of these cards are fairly easy to get okay so here we go we should get quite a few different combos on this one so zombies and night of the living dead and let's get that one out of the way the brainiest combo nice one for halloween one three six mind you we did play an extra card there i shouldn't have done that but it's the first two cards there night of the living dead and zombies that's a cool combo next one we've got is gonna be let's have a look virginia wolf is with the lighthouse um what we got uh here we go the wolves to the northern winter is coming in combo great that's a good one and dire wolf dire wolf's quite a difficult card to get the two two one that was a great score on that combo actually really good score i'm impressed with that nice very nice um so we've got three possible ah uh, here we go we've got the pink ones here have we yep there we go i like this one this is cool one six eight spring up flowers really nice pink moon and moss pink beautiful field one six eight not a bad scoring one these ones seem to be a little bit more high scoring actually so good and we've got the fountain of youth in our hand as well it's a cool combo coming up and uh, here we go so these two oceans and seas this is one that we saw earlier now let's play fountain of youth and him youth restoration why i remember that's good one at three nine not a bad score so we've got another combo which like i said is those two dolphins we can play them or if we get the lighthouse we might play virginia no no virginia so let's go with these two cool cards one at six eight that's better and this is the one classic Cetaceans. that was the one that our opponent played earlier that's good one at five two mellotron that's strawberry fields so what goes with strawberry fields some strawberries obviously eaten mess there we go uh should we do that one yeah let's do that one eat a mess made with strawberry strawberry feels forever cool song don't think they used a mellotron though you never know strawberry feels forever oh, i think the zeppelin no the butter and the butter we go together but we'll see that one in a second still waiting for the lighthouse to come round for virginia oh we actually lost that round as well this is good though we're getting loads of combos out together uh there we go so we got Virginia and the Lighthouse, Lighthouse of Alexandria to the Lighthouse combo. That's a great one. Really good. And then Butter Lamb and Krishna's Butter Ball definitely go together. No surprise there with that one. I didn't see the score on uh, Virginia there. I don't think it would have been very good. We're 109 behind. Um, oh, I don't think we've got it. Well, Butter Ball, yes, we have. What am I talking about? 101. Butter Lamb and Krishna's Butter Buddies combo. Nice picture as well, that one. 101 points. Again, not the highest scoring combos. I think the combo should really have extra points or something because what's the point of a combo if they're not any good? Uh, okay, so no, there we go. This is, I think this is a Zeppelin. Or could I be wrong? Yeah, that's the way combo. That was nice. I was a little bit unsure about that one. And I think we've managed to get pretty much every combo from this deck. We've been lucky with the card order. Really lucky. Night of the Living Dead and Zombies we've already seen. So there we go. I think we might have... No, I think that's probably... Have we got any more? Let's have a look. Have I got any more combos to show you? Strawberry Fields, that's another one that I just got there. Youth Restoration, that's two. Spring Flowers, three. We should get quite a lot from this deck. Brainius, Brains, whatever it is, four. That's the way, five. Winter is coming, six. Wow, this is really good. And more to the Lighthouse, seven. 
classic Cassations 8. Battle Buddies 9. Wow. Okay, that must put us over 20, 20 combo achievements that we've shown you in this video. Do check out parts 1 and 2. I'm just going to have a quick look. Uh, so that's that deck I put together. Um, yeah, we've managed to get everything from that deck. That's really good. Uh, where am I going? I don't want to be here. I want to look at achievements. Uh, let's get out of here. That's that deck code. Yeah, have I got that right? Yeah, VV593N. That's a cool one. Try and put that one together. I think there's some really good combos in there. And then I'm just going to show you the achievements and the rewards before we finish this uh, video. Just in case you don't know what I'm talking about. If you go into the quests and achievements tab on the bottom left there and rewards let's have a look whoops let's have a look at achievements first recently achieved these are all the ones that we've done today wow there's loads of them recently achieved look at that all of these as you can see we've completed 212 out of 436 but you only need 250 achievements to max out your rewards there we go oh i'm on 225 oh i can claim a reward let's claim the reward while you guys are here just to show you how good these are. What are we going to get? 9,000 XP. Not bad. That's going to help us. A limited epic. A limited legendary. I think I've already got him. And a mystery card. What is the mystery card? Is that a mythic? No, it's Jane Austen. Is that a mythic? No, it's Jane Austen. Come on. Oh, I don't think I've got Jane Austen. So I'm happy with that one another limited legendary so two limited legendaries on that reward and nine thousand points well worth collecting those achievements and like you can start off at number one and work your way all the way up to there we go 250 and our next goal is that awesome octopus anyhow guys i hope you enjoyed that do check out the links in the description uh certainly for the discord servers and we will be back very soon with some more videos take care bye